Hey ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel, Basic Economics with Joseph. So this is going to be a quick video of one of my vending locations. You can say number one, number two, whatever. This is actually one of four locations I have and seven machines. However, this machine behind me is a combo machine. Now, I don't remember the exact name. Oh, it's right here. It's a, uh, it's a model 3589, I guess. I don't know. So I'm gonna... yeah. But anyways... Um, this is the combo machine that holds 20 snacks and I want to say, I don't, have to say, I don't remember on the drink choices, I'm sorry. Um, but everything's stocked up, um, did this morning. So I just, wanted to show you, I just wanted to show you guys one of my locations. Um, the good news is, um, I haven't checked, the good news is I haven't checked the cash box yet. So usually I check the cash box like once every week. Um, but I didn't have a check this week, and uh, we'll see. Here's my card. My card is in the door, my window. It says quality over quanti quality over quantity. I try to give a quality service. You know, the key to greatness. You know, service to many leads to greatness. Jim Rome. All right. So let's check the cash box and let's see what we got. See what we got here. We got a little cash in there. Not sure how much. Honestly, probably around 50, 50, 60 dollars for a week. These guys are these guys are pretty aggressive. Um put that back on. If I can put it back on, give me a second, y'all. So here we go. A little bit of cash. And that doesn't that doesn't include quarters and coins. But I had nothing. I made the mistake of not putting, uh, grabbing something to carry the coins. So I'll just leave them in there for next time. But basically, all the uh, money I make, I just put it back into the business. I do take about 10% off. Remember, always pay yourself first. I do take 10% off the top and I put it in a different asset just to back my business up. And usually, that asset is something, a commodity, uh, you know, something that's not going to. Uh, disappear with with the inflation speaking of inflation the one thing i don't really that kind of sucks about having this business is and it's you know if it's any corporation any business uh when prices uh go up when i you know purchase the goods for my machine well what do you think that means for my business i have to raise the prices here which which is unfortunate because it again it Curves, you know, not only does it curve my pocket, you know, my business, but it also uh, curves my clients as well. And so they're looking like, damn, why are prices keep going up? I'll just be like, I'm just competing, you know, I just got to keep competing, make sure, you know, prices are competitive, but at the same time, I still have to make a profit. And that's, you know, it's very, and that's what you're seeing, you know, the, you know, is around the world is just everything is getting more expensive just because the purchasing power and the currencies just continuing to get devalued and devalued and devalued all around the world, ladies and gentlemen, all around the world. Very sad, very unfortunate. But anyways, this is one of my locations. All right. Um, these trays, this is my combo machine. It's probably my favorite machine. These slide out real easy, real simple, as you can see. Slide in, slide out. All right. Um, great machine. Everything. This one's, this one's, everything's full stock. But that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I just want to show you a, a quick little preview of, of my, one of my locations. Um, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace. If you have any questions, let me know.